Hey guys, we will solve the lab routing base SSRF. The level of this lab is practitioner and the goal is to access the internal admin panel located in the IP range 192.168.0.0/24. Then delete Carlos. Okay, access the lab. Okay, um, the HTTP history, look for the request to the web application and send the request to repeater. Switch to repeater and open the verb collaborator client. Copy to clipboard and replace the value of the host header with the domain of the verb collaborator. Send the request and switch to the verb collaborator client and push the button point now. You see some DNS packages and one HTTP package. That confirms that we are able to make the website's middleware issue request to an arbitrary server. Now we can close the verb collaborator client. Switch to verb proxy and open the HTTP history. The get request to the web application which we send to the burp repeater should now send to burp intruder switch to burp intruder open the tab positions and click the button clear we will delete the host header or we will replace the host header with our IP address 192.168.0.0 and we will add the last O for the payloads. Now switch to the payloads tab and change the payload type to numbers. We will start at O to 255 and step is 1. Start the attack. Yes, the host header in the request does not match the specified target host, but we can ignore it. Okay, it's finished. We look for its status code 302. And you see the IP address is 192.168.0.33. Send this request to repeater. Okay, and the burp repeater, we add the admin to the URL and send it to the application. You see we received an HTTP 200 OK, which means that we have access to the admin panel. In the response is a form for deleting users. This form uses the post method. The pass is admin delete 
and a required input field is the username and we have also an CSRF token which is needed to delete the user. Okay, first the path is delete question mark CSRF paste this one and username is Carlos. Okay. Also copy the session token, copy and put it in the cookie header. So and send the request. You see we successfully deleted the user Carlos.